How can ADO e-bike resist the temperature change, temperature tolerance of the ADO e-bike? Safety first and prevention is better than cure. In ADO Environmental Simulation Laboratory, we tested the temperature tolerance of our products by simulating the real and extreme temperature conditions to ensure the product's stabilization and safety. Besides testing the absolute temperatures, we also consider the frequency and the speed of temperature changes for the durability of the electronic components of an e-bike. ADO QTL Laboratory work according to a variety of international standards. The first test is the temperature shock test. For the temperature shock test, we use a two-chamber air-to-air -air system. The maximum temperature of the hot chamber is set at 80 degrees Celsius and the cold chamber at minus 40 degrees Celsius. The tester is transported back and forth between the hot and cold chambers several times. Through this experiment, weaknesses are identified, upgraded, and adjusted. Therefore, we ensure that ADO's products work well even in extreme temperature conditions. The second is high-low temperature storage test. We created the test chambers with a constant temperature of minus 40 degrees Celsius and 70 degrees Celsius respectively. E-bikes are stored in these test chambers for 48 hours. This provides the basis for the safe storage of ADO e-bikes in all climates and storms around the world. The third is functional testing under extreme temperature conditions. We simulated the minus 15 degrees Celsius and 45 degrees Celsius, as well as the outdoor conditions such as shocks and loads. Our e-bikes are run continuously for 12 hours in the tester chamber to confirm that ADO e-bikes can be ridden safely in all conditions. ADO e-bike guarantees that every bike from ADO will pass 100% of the tester requirements, making it the cornerstone of your short-distance travel.